And this is why we may not be seeing clouds coming in the 20.1 update coming to our infinite flight mobile devices. Stay tuned to hear the rest. Hello ladies and gentlemen, Xcentaur here and welcome back to another YouTube video. I hope you're all doing amazing because I sure as am. And today I got some news on the Burn 777 update or rework update and clouds when they're coming to infinite flight. So please stay tuned, I'm just going to quickly say something and then we can get straight into the video without wasting any more time. Uh, if you're new to the channel, like and subscribe, you guys know what to do. Loving the amazing support at the moment, we're not far from 2k now, hopefully we can hit it within a week now. So it's crazy, we're not. We're about 70 subs away, so it's really cool, thank you so much for that. Also, check out my merch, link in the description, I'll play in that button now. Other than that, after that we'll get straight into the video. Are you after some new clothes or something to keep you warm? Well, I know, just the place to go. Head over to the Xcentaur merch store where you can buy anything going from hoodies to t-shirts to even phone cases now. Go check out what's there. Thank you. Okay, well, make sure you check out the merch link in the description. News let's get straight into the video. So last night I was scrolling through Twitter as always. I need to turn notifications on for infinite flights before I miss any important news, which I will one day. Um, but they um, they tweeted out this and it said as hashtag burn triple seven two development continues a separate team is hard at work developing the first version of clouds for infinite flight please be aware that some features shown may not be available in the 20.1 full stop right so before we start anything as you can see there are clouds in the background of this image but this does not mean they're coming together so infinite flight what they mean is they um they do not know if clouds are coming with the 777 rework um, this is the first time I think I've ever seen them unsure on whether it's going to come, whether something's going to come with an update. But from what I can tell, um, clouds will be coming in 20.2 or maybe even 20.3, I believe. So that would be interesting. I think clouds might be their own update. Um, I mainly think that because a separate team is hard at work developing the first version of clouds. So that means that there are two different teams that are de developing at the moment. There's one team developing clouds, and there's another team developing the triple seven. From what they've said, um, now that means they they may not be working together, so they're probably working at different speeds. And by the looks of it, it looks like the clouds team may not get clouds ready for the 20.1 update, which is understandable. They work really hard. I know all these developers work hard, and I'm fairly cool, cool, for <laughs> I'm fairly sure quite a few of them are volunteers. Jeez, sorry for that. I'm, I'm not even going to cut that out. You know, stay original. Um, so yeah, um, a separate team continues work. So basically, we will not see the clouds in Triple Seven in the next update. If we do, that'd be amazing. But I'm pretty sure this tweet is just to like make sure no one's disappointed. Because um, I know I have been saying in a few previous videos that they may be coming together. I never said they're definitely coming together. I may have said they are. Um, but yeah. This is just confirmation, unfortunately. Now, the airline there, that's right, guys. I know you, some of you were looking at that tail. Now, it took me a few minutes to realize what it was, so I went down to the comment sections, and the airline's been identified as Varig, V-A-R-I-G. Now, uh, Varig was the first airline founded in Brazil in 1927. Um, from 1965 until 1990, it was Brazil's leading airline, and it was the only international Brazilian airline. Um, they seized operations on the 20th of July 2006, and its headquarters were in Rio, by the looks of it. Um, its hubs were Rio Jalilio Tom Jobim International Airport, and its parent organisation was Gold. So, we're all very familiar with Gold. So, that's right, a new livery confirmed, and it's more of an old school livery. So, it, it will fit quite nice in, I think, having a nice old school livery on the 777. Whoa. So that'll be really, really interesting. Um, check out my Twitter as well, link in the description. Check out my Instagram, link in the description. Uh, join my Discord, link in the description, guys. Please, please, there is a link to my Discord in the description. I cannot keep sending you individual links because it is time consuming when I when I have other videos to edit. Other than that, I hope you enjoyed today's YouTube video. Uh, please, please make sure you can um, enjoy the video. Uh, uh, no, 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 sorry. Please, please make sure you stay safe. Uh, current, uh, no, no, I can't say that YouTube would demonetize. Um, just stay safe with the current pandemic you're all aware of. Other than that, I'll see you in tomorrow's YouTube video. Good night.
Are you after some new clothes or something to keep you warm? Well, I know, just the place to go head over to the Exentorium merch store where you can buy anything. Go from hoodies to t-shirts to even phone cases now. Go check out what's there. Thank you.